This is gonna be a short video, straight to the point. Look at the screen. We got a map up. This is a map that comes directly from businessinsider.com. You know I had to get the white man for it. You know these dudes only listen to the white man. Let's get into it. This is a map which highlights the most common countries of birth for foreign born residents in the United States, excluding Mexico. Let's get into it. Let's start up in the Northeast. All right, we got Canada. Canada to Canada, three. We got China. We got the DR, the Dominicans, coming up twice on the Northeast. And even though the Dominicans come up twice, that little territory they control is so tiny, it's irrelevant. Let's get back into it. Coming up next, we got India. India, India. India, India. India, India. India, India. El Salvador, India. India, India. Guatemala, Vietnam. Honduras, Vietnam. India, Guatemala. Ethiopia, Somalia. Canada, Cuba, Germany, India, India, Philippines, Canada, 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 Philippines, Philippines, Vietnam, India. And there you have it. We don't got to spend too much time really debunking it. We've debunked it. So it's not the black immigrant that FBA should have a problem with, that Tariq she should have a problem with. In fact, the black man has nothing to do with this. And it's so crazy because I know Haitians are deep in the United States. And even to the point where we're as deep as we are, we still don't even crack anywhere on the list. The Dominicans got more territory than we do. That's crazy, bro. And Haitians been coming through here since like 1776. That goes to show you how black immigrants really aren't even a factor when it comes to the American landscape of politics and economics like that. We got our little pockets and our little sections, but we ain't really, you know, shaking the table like that. So we already debunked that whole replacement theory, that whole black immigrants, they come in and take over the resources and the jobs and the scholarships and the grants and the property and everything we work for and we build a country. Bro, we already debunked that, bro. It doesn't exist. It can't exist because the Canadians and the Indians, they, they swallowing up territory, bro. They swallowing up territory. It's not the Nigerian. It's not the Jamaican. It's not the Haitian. You got your weapons fixed on the wrong targets. You need to aim your weapons towards Balji. You need to direct that energy towards Deepak. You need to direct that energy towards Arnesh. You need to aim that energy towards Pratesh. All right, the Indian boys. You need to direct the energy towards the Canadian boys because the Canadians, man, they out here deep, bro. They got a whole section of the United States all to themselves, bro. They just running things. You know? <laughs> I didn't even know. I, I didn't even know they had it on lock like that, bro. So you need to stop worrying about the Haitians, the Jamaicans, the Nigerians, and the Somalians, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Even though the Somalians do got, you know, Minnesota, I believe. But even then, you know, y'all not really tripping over Minnesota. Y'all be living in Arkansas and Tennessee and you know Mississippi and things like that. So y'all ain't tripping over Minnesota. But at the end of the day, the great replacement theory that Tariq Nasheed is trying to push how the white boys be trying to push how the white boys be like oh the minorities and the blacks and the Mexicans they come in and take everything we worked for we built the country they come in and take the country and then now Tariq Nasheed has his own version of that where the black immigrants the Jamaicans and you know the Nigerians they come in and take the country but see the white boys are actually following the stats they're actually looking at the numbers and they're not even worried about black immigrants they're worried about what's going on at the border whereas Tariq Nasheed is creating enemies out of thin air and deciding to fight against them and going to crusade against them so he's just delusional borderline schizophrenic but on a serious note yeah i would highly advise y'all to direct your energy towards the indian boys because as we know the hispanic boys they're they about to come in here you know what i mean be up in the over office pretty soon we're gonna be running the country they're gonna be having everything on lock pretty soon they pouring in here like a faucet that's leaking bro they coming in here by the boatloads and then the indian boys they swallowing up territory on the low key so they probably gonna have the economy on lock in the future so listen you got to direct your energy towards those two groups not the black immigrant. The black immigrant, he just chilling in the corner, stacking his bread, sending his kids to school, watching the news, drinking a beer. That's it, man. That's all it is, bro. You got other enemies to go against, and it ain't the black immigrants. It ain't the Haitian. It ain't the Jamaican. It ain't the Trinidadian. It ain't the Nigerian. It ain't the Ghanaian. It ain't the Belizean. And listen, these are not my stats. This chart came from businessinsider.com. Because they tracking the economy. They tracking the money. They on top of things. They crunching the numbers, and they painting the picture. Unlike Tariq. Who just be painting pictures, but I don't know what he be painting. He just be using his imagination. But anyways, man, it's your boy Nefakari Destiny back in the billing. Yes, indeed. And I'm gone. Peace. Reincarnated, I'm back in the original fashion. I left on a horse and came back in that ass. And I left with abundance and came back to famine. We used to be pyramids, now we be rapping. Look how the mighty have fallen. Used to be running, now we be walking. When you be cooning, that's when they applauded. Selling your soul, your sons and your daughter. Gotta come up in this shit. They stuck in the mix. Really, my heart it be breaking. That's why I'm stacking that paper and handle my business. Pass it down in generation. Talking about money and power and building a nation. That's the dedication.
deadly combination. Never be watching the TV, they pushing the genus. Falsifying information. Now they got malice intentions. Step in the room and I'm feeling the tension. Enemy watching, he blocking my vision. Pay for the check, cause I need my redemption. Building my kingdom, I need it protected. Ready for war like a young money Congo. Never decided the team is the motto. Up in the crib and I'm whipping up waffles. Up in the crib and I'm smoking gelato. I'm chilling, I'm taking my pain and making it ambition. I'm blessed by the gods, but I ain't religious. I can't feel the power, they can't feel the bitch. They make a no hour with it, wedge. I got business. This shit is an art, and it can never be taught. Selling my soul, I can never be bought. Play with my money, I see you in court. Run to the check and I do it for sport. Babylon falling, I go to the source. Packing my luggage and go overseas. Shorty be with me and she so at least. Shorty be charged that I'm calling her Hershey. Secret intelligence probably gonna murder me. Don't fuck with brands, cause nigga, I'm Haitian. Say the wrong shit and you